he's been an inspiration to me. I've learned so much from him on how to engage other organisations outside of the council because, you know, we are very, we have particular ways of doing stuff, but we've engaged other organisations. The Livable Place Board has been a very important achievement of Kareem's. We've actually moved this city on. These things just don't happen as a matter of course, otherwise they would have happened everywhere over the country. That is why we have been successful. We are the, one of the top performing cities in the country. We need to carry on that legacy. He will leave us in good stead. He will carry on his notice period and work with me and other members of the team to make sure that that legacy continues. I've got a fantastic interim chief executive with Bindu. She will be fantastic. I know that. She will be good for the city and taking the agenda forward, but she will be Bindu and we will carry on that fight to make sure Exeter stays up there, stays important and continues to stay strong. It's a bit like a relay race, isn't it? We have to hand the baton on a fresh pair of legs to take it to the next person. That's what Peter done, uh, Roy Slack, Peter Edwards, he's handed the baton to me. Kareem has handed the baton now to Bindu. I will hand the baton. I've still got a few more circuits to go yet. And this is all about how the council, how good leadership evolves, making sure the vision that you've all agreed upon takes priority. So we congratulate people, we thank people, but it's about the city which we must all think about and the people who live in it.